Hi guys, uh, so if you're getting this error, uh, let's uh, try to fix it. Uh, the most basic method uh, to fix this error, uh, if you don't want to, you know, do anything uh, techy, is just go to this link from uh, Microsoft. Okay, go to this link. I have pasted this link in the description of the video. And download that troubleshooter and run it. Maybe it will fix your problem. But if it do not fix your problem, let's try to fix it. Now, just search regedit in the Windows 10 search box. Now, click on registry editor to open it. Now, in the registry editor, you have to go to this path. Okay. This path is for 64-bit PCs. Uh, most of the modern machines are 64-bit. So, we have to go to this path after computer and a slash just paste this path i have pasted this path in the description of the video given below hit enter key and you will reach here now what you have to do is to just click on uh, one by one click on the, uh, these folders in the left menu and see okay uh, the program by the display name okay so one by one you can see okay so let's say this is the program you have identified the program this is my program which i'm trying to uninstall and i'm getting this error so in that case what you have to do uh, in the same window just see uninstall string okay for that particular program uh, just go to uninstall string double click on it and this is the value data you have to copy just copy it okay now search cmd in the windows 10 search box right click on it click on run as administrator and now paste it okay and hit enter key and it will uninstall the program so this is a very basic method note that if some of the users have 32 bit pc you have to go to this path uh, sorry you have to go to this path i have pasted both this path in the description of the video given below you can directly copy those paths from there now if this also do not work what happens try to uninstall uh, the program in safe mode but in safe mode uh, msi uninstaller or installer is not working by it's disabled by default so what you have to do uh, you can uh, easily do it with registry editor just open the registry editor again okay now, uh, before doing anything with registry, even with, uh, before the first method, you should always take a backup. Just click on file and click on export and take a backup. Name it. Okay. And take a backup. So that if anything bad happens, you can click on file and click on import that backup to fix the, uh, you know, changes. Now, once you have taken the backup of the registry, what you have to do, just go to this path. Okay. HK local machine system control set control say boot minimal okay after computer and forward slash just paste this path hit enter i have also pasted this path in the description of the video going below now once you have pasted this path now what you have to do right click on it click on new and click on key okay so create a new key in the minimal Right click on minimal, click on new, click on key and name this key MSI server. Okay, name this key MSI server and in the right side just once you have selected this MSI server is being selected, just double click on default and name this as service. Okay, click on OK. Now you have to restart your computer in safe mode okay just boot the computer in safe mode how to uh, do this just search ms config and just click on boot and check this safe boot okay and click on okay and it will restart your computer in safe mode go into safe mode and try to uninstall the program now and it will work now if this also do not work let's move to method three and that is just search USC, okay, in the Windows 10 search box, click on change user account control settings and drag this to the minimum, okay, 
and now try to uninstall the program and let's see if it fixes your problem or not. So that's it guys, please do like the video and subscribe to the channel for supporting us.